Hi Sagittarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your weekly August 21st through the 27th love reading. This is going to be a quickie. I wasn't going to do weekly readings, but due to all the requests I decided to do it. Uh, so this is for Sagittarius. What do you have for Sagittarius? August 21st through the 27th regarding love. does not stick. I'm sorry. It's driving me freaking crazy. There we go. Alright. I just wanted to make sure they were good and mixed up. You're my first reading of the day. shut the washing machine off, but I'm just going to lay these cards out first. I changed the uh, area where I do my readings and I forgot about the washing machine. It's a new one. So, you know, shouldn't be making noise, but I do have a pack, so that's the way it goes. Anyhow, um, we'll get back to your reading now. I'm real. That's all there is to it. This ain't no professional gig. <laughs> all right. So, it looks like you're starting to make some changes. Perhaps you've been envisioning the future. Now, this is not This is supposed to be a love reading. Okay, and I think that you, the stuff, the, whatever you're envisioning involves a, uh, financial security. I think that's a big focus this week. I think that, you know, I just think that's a big focus. And I think, um, there you are, right here. Um, I think that you have been really taking action. You've been working on yourself. You've been showing what you're made of. I think that your self-worth and your self-respect is way, way up there. I think that you're feeling really, really good this week. And perhaps you're doing things pretty fast. I think there's, a, there's some fast energy here. So I think that whatever delays you've been going through, they're over. Now, I know we're looking for a love reading. And right here, it tells me this is a lot about you. And, you know, how you affects your love life is a very big deal, Okay. So I think this week so far what I see is that you are really, really working on yourself and that you are, your, your confidence and your courage and your self-respect and your self-worth is way, way up there. And I think that you have taken action to better um, your life, all right? So I think that's what I see. Um, I, th I see that you've been concentrating on yourself and because of that, Things are finally starting to happen. I think things are starting to move in a positive direction. You could have a Libra in your life. Uh, Gemini, Libra. Did I say Libra? I did, didn't I? An air sign. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius in your life at this time. That is helping you on your journey to rediscovery. Because that's what it looks like to me. It looks like you, you're you changing your ways in in a lot of ways all right so i just think i see a lot of change here this week i see this is uh something from the past okay so let's get some more cards wow things have quieted right down perhaps and you know everything that comes out during this reading is meant for what you even if it's something about my personal life the minute I hit record, the reading is for you, okay? So, 
I just said things have quieted right down. That was a message for you. I think that your life has quieted down a bit. Um, <laughs> and I think that you are changing very quickly. I think that something inside of you is changing very quickly. That's where the fast energy is. And I think it's because of your your thoughts and your manifestations, you know, your your positive attitude. I think the negativity that you may have had the week before or a couple weeks ago is starting to dissolve because I see a lot of positive energy here. I see that you've, you're starting over. It feels like you're starting over on something and you're really seriously manifesting and taking action. It looks like you're using all your resources to succeed, so that's fantastic. Inner conflicts are starting to dissolve and I think that you're starting to feel more comfortable at home. You're starting to feel more comfortable um, with yourself. I think that um, you are about to start a new phase of your life because of your newfound um, confidence, okay? I think you're, you have this new confidence about you that has happened very quickly. Um, and that's awesome. It really is. I need delays are over. I think that maybe you're, there's something. Um, this is where you were ignoring. You were ignoring the past. You were ignoring something. And you decided, to, you decided that you couldn't ignore it anymore. Okay, so I'm not sure what it was, but I feel like you were ignoring something. You decided you couldn't ignore it anymore. Things started to happen fast. Okay, and so you started to change pretty quickly. I see a complete start over. It's almost, it is. I see a complete start over where, you know, you you just change, a big change, something very, very big. It's like one phase of your life is over and another one has begun. Okay, and I think that your focus, it has completely changed. You've gone from kind of feeling negative to feeling positive, com com from kind of feeling down to feeling um, abundant almost. And that doesn't mean in riches. That means in, in self, all right? I feel like you've just made a major shift in, in thought process or something. I think your self-worth and your self-confidence has really picked it up a notch this week. Um, there's a lot of change going on. Yep. And you have been working on it. You have made this happen. You have taken action. Um, you know, there may be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius that is included in your home life. Now, this could be anybody. Okay? But there, it seems like this person is included in your, in your home situation. Um... Perhaps there's been some power struggles in the past, but it looks like any tension may be dissolving. Now, this may or may not resonate with you because, you know, there's so many people that watch these readings. Um, so if it doesn't, then so be it. Um, I do see that you're moving on. You're moving on. Just finally, things are changing. This is the week of fucking change. I think that... You know, you've been changing right along, but here it's a big deal. This is the manifestation of it where, you know, you've been changing one little step at a time, one little step at a time to bring back your self-confidence and your self-worth and and to feel confident. I see that you're conf This is a lot of confidence here. And I think it's because you have taken action and you're ready to take a, a start a new journey. You're ready to start something brand new that you don't have any expertise in and that perhaps that's a positive attitude, okay? Yeah, looks pretty good. We're going to get some of these. These are my this is my after tarot. This is my new deck. I happen to love it, so we're going to do it. I don't read the cards like any other reader. I use mostly my intuition. I do use the cards as well, but it comes, it's, you know, it is the way it is. I don't, I don't read like the next one, as you can see. You've changed your shift and where you focus your energy. There's no doubt about it. You've changed, I think you went from negative thinking to positive thinking. And I think it's from manifesting. I think it's over past hurt. You're about to start a new journey. 
I think that, you know, as far as any new love comes in, I don't see any new love coming in. I see that you might already have somebody in your home life that is a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, and perhaps there's been some power struggles. If um, you don't have somebody, this could be somebody on the outside um, that has been affecting you. All right, so there is somebody that's been affecting you, and, you know, it's affected your... Um, comfortableness put it that way but I think that's over I think any tension that there was is over because I see you starting a new phase of your life where um, positive thinking and positive um, a positive forward path where you leave you just don't have any expertise in it okay you don't whatever this is it's something it's brand new it's a new project it's a new phase of life that is definitely going to affect your home. Okay, it's a it's forward movement movement. I mean, you could have an airy. What the fuck? <coughs> Sorry, um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius um, coming in. All right, you could you could. They could be interested in you. They could see the, your shift. They could see that you have shifted from negative to positive, and you know they're very interested in you. Um, so yeah, that, I mean, that person could be coming in. We do have Aries a couple times. We do have Gemini a couple times. We have you right up there. So. <laughs> it's great. I love it. You are changing. Like I said, this is a ch week of change. And I think that you've manifested it. Not that you haven't been changing before this week. But this is this is what's going on here. Things are real. This is a big week. Okay. This is where things start to happen because you've changing. Because you this, this guy is now, this is the after tarot. Okay. It's a little bit different than the regular tarot. It's just the afterthoughts. But I read it my way. I didn't even look up any of the meetings in this book because I, I don't. Okay, so this right here is drinking from the cup of love. And the other one he's going to offer to somebody, but now this is you drinking the love. Instead of the negative thoughts, this is the positive thoughts. That's what it is. Towards love. Okay, and that's so attractive. So keep doing that. Here, this is the, this is the gift of manifestation. You have been manifesting this. Okay, this is stability, security, um that you have received okay it's growth all right so finally this is the growth that you you know the seeds were planted and you've been planted you've been watering them you've been doing it and now we see growth okay this is a cancer oh jesus i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry capricorn virgo or taurus person and they are they could be interested in you or they could be part of your life as well Okay, and maybe they've helped you to move forward. I'm not sure, but I see that um, this is very practical. This is sensible. This is um, trusted. So perhaps this is just energy, and it's not even a person coming in at all. This is probably you, all right? Being more practical, being more sensible, being more trusted. Maybe, maybe you are um, being seen as being more trusted all right maybe you're being more seen as being more respectable i don't know i don't know this guy is very respected he's worked for his name all right he's earned it so you know that's what this is so i think it's energy for you things are finally starting to move forward in your life that's what i see this is a breakthrough Okay, it's a breakthrough. This is what this the breakthrough is. You go from negative thinking to positive thinking. That is a breakthrough. And that's when your life starts over. That's what the fool is. This is a start over. This is about taking back your power and taking action and focusing your energy on your your new phase, your next phase of life. Leaving the past behind. This is the past, leaving it behind. Moving away from the past, leaving the past behind, moving forward. <laughs> Again, we have more action being taken. All right, you are definitely taking action. I think you're starting to follow your passions. 
All right, I see there's a lot of passion here. You're starting to take action. It does look like, um, you know, you go from one to being two. So instead of being on your own so much, maybe you start to have some ally. Okay, it looks like you're going to have an ally, whereas before you didn't. So that's fantastic. And it's all because of you. It's all because of you. It's all because this is you. Okay, it's all because you decided to take action and drink from the cup of love. And once you drink from the cup of love, you are love. Okay, so I mean, hey, go ahead. I mean, if the more positive you are, the, the more love is going to come in. That's for damn sure. So this right here, as you drink from this cup of love, <laughs> no shit. And things happen very quickly. And it brings you happiness. A lot of happiness and bliss. And a comfortable home life, which is underneath. Okay? This is passion. Okay, so you could have somebody that sees what you're doing. That sees how much you have grown, how much you have changed, how much your self-confidence has come back and your self-worth. And they might be very interested in you now, okay? There could be a very high sexual attraction now because we have this fiery energy here. And because you've made these changes, you're becoming more attractive. That's what I see, okay? Because you did the right thing for you. You did the right thing for you. So things happen fast. That's how the universe works. Okay? So, um... Whew! I don't feel the need to do any more. I don't. I feel like this is, is, hit, is it. Congratulations. I think you've reached a turning point and finally things are going to start to happen for you. So that is what I have. Thank you for watching. And I will talk to you soon. Please subscribe if you liked. I'm going to just zoom that in real quick because I'm not sure how good you can see it. You know what? I might even give you a better view. It looks pretty good. Yeah. It does look pretty good, doesn't it? Things are going to happen very, very fast for you. That's all there is to it. Okay. And you've done it. You did it. The end.